Hello traders, today's top stories, the Fed FOMC statement will be examined carefully today regarding its outlook. It's Wednesday, May the 3rd, and here is our New York Review. U.S. investors and their global counterparts will turn their attention en masse to the Federal Reserve, which will publish their monetary policy statement later today. Wall Street produced slight gains yesterday on cautious trading, but the major indexes continue to touch important high water marks. No interest rate hike will come from the Fed today, however, investors will be keen to see what the U.S. central bank's outlook declares. Recent U.S. data has been disappointing. Yesterday's total vehicle sales numbers showed a decline in consumer activity. A non-manufacturing reading will also come from the Institute for Supply Management today in the States. However, the Federal Reserve will get the predominant amount of focus and its statement will cause an impact. Asian markets, which were open today, turn in cautious trading. Japan and South Korea both celebrated banking holidays, and forex markets were quiet. The Kaixin Services Purchasing Managers Index result will be issued for China on early Thursday, and a result of 52.6 is projected. The Shanghai Shenzhen Composite has posted tentative trading the past week, but investors seem to be reacting favorably to China's recent acknowledge that its shadow banking industry needs better supervision. European indexes have opened with slight losses today as investors have turned cautious before the U.S. Federal Reserve's monetary policy pronouncements. The euro and pound have held on to their strong values and remain locked in range against the U.S. dollar. The 1.10 mark for the euro remains a distant resistance level. PMI data from Europe yesterday came in near their estimates for Germany, France and Italy. UK manufacturing data outperformed its forecast with a result of 57.3, which helped bolster the pound. Gross domestic product numbers have come from Europe today, but investors on the continent will largely be US-centric with their decision-making in the coming hours. Gold remains under pressure in early trading today. The Federal Reserve's statement later today will factor into precious metal trading. The 1,250 US dollar an ounce mark looks to be an important support level today. Speculators, speculators appear cautious in the gold market in the short term. Global traders will read through the Federal Reserve's FOMC statement carefully upon its publication at 6 p.m. GMT. Thank you all for watching, have a great trading day and we will see you again soon.